Also tonight, a Battle Creek man says the Fox 17 problem solvers helped get back some of the money a local construction company owed him. Yeah, this is an update to a story we first brought you last week. We have Marisa Oberly in studio live with the latest details, Marisa. Yeah, Max and Josh, this man is just so excited about this update. I got a call from him this morning. His name is Raymond Morris, and he said Bay to Bay Building Concepts LLC refunded him just over $800. Raymond hired the Hastings Construction Company over the summer to fix two sections of his roof. A crew finished one job, but he canceled the second repair after realizing that leak stemmed from the air conditioning unit and not his roof. Raymond claimed Bay to Bay owed him $1,250 for it. When we spoke last month, he was still waiting on that cash. However, after a few days after our story aired, Raymond says Bay to Bay called him and offered to give the money back, but noted they would add a 30% cancellation fee stipulated in his contract. On Monday, he picked up a check for $875. Raymond says the money will help pay for his wife's medical bills. Bay to Bay did not respond to our interview requests about his case. It's a blessing. This show that justice for the it's justice for the consumer. And somebody has Fox News makes justice for consumers. So that's not get any better than that. And in July, the Michigan Department of Licensing and Regulatory Affairs suspended the company's builder's license and the one that belongs to its corporate officer, Gerald Saman. They reached a settlement with Laura at the end of last month, but it still needs to be approved by a state board. Laura says until that happens, the suspension remains in place and neither Beta Bay or Saman can do business. If someone does suspect a contractor of operating with a suspended license, officials encourage them to report it to the Bureau of Construction Codes. Reporting in the studio, tonight. Marisa Oberly, Fox MT News.